Royal Gloucestershire, Berkshire and Hampshire Regiment that are based at Hanbury Barracks, Hampshire. The Royal Welsh Volunteers are based in New Malmes Barracks, all the shops and their appropriate operation in the back. The Royal Regiment of Wales are based at Barton Barracks, Hanbury. Devonshire and Norfolk Regiment in Malmes Barracks, Canterbury. The 22nd Cheshire Regiment are in Kiwi Barracks, Hanbury and also are currently on operations for that. The Staffordshire Regiment are at Walton Barracks and Kidman. The Worcestershire and Sherwood Forest Regiment are at the Dale Camp in Manchester.
This is awarded to the recruit who has been the best shot consistently throughout the course. Best endeavour. This is awarded to the recruit who, in the eyes of the permanent staff, has not necessarily produced the best results overall, but has always given 100% and has improved the most over the course. Best at physical training. This is awarded to the recruit who has performed the best at physical training throughout the course. And finally, the best recruit. This is awarded to the recruit who has performed consistently well in all areas of training, in barracks and in the field. Best shot goes to Fusilier Hogg, Royal Regiment of Fusiliers of 6th Platoon, Queen's Division Company. Private Escort, Royal Gloucestershire, Berkshire and Wiltshire Regiment of 4th Platoon, Prince of Wales, Div Company. And Private Harrell, Light Infantry of 4th Platoon, Light Division Company. Best Endeavour goes to Private Craven, Royal Anglian Regiment of 6th Platoon, Queen's Division Company. Private Bryce, 3-2, Devon and Dorset Regiment of 4th Platoon, Prince of Wales Division Company. Private MacDonald, Light Infantry of 4th Platoon, Light Division Company. Best of Physical Training goes to Private Glossop, Royal Anglian Regiment of 6th Platoon, Queen's Division Company. Devonshire and Dorset Regiment of 4th Platoon Prince of Wales Division Company and Rifleman Hemmings Royal Green Jackets of 4th Platoon Light Division Company. Best recruit goes to Fusilier Mason, Royal Regiment of Fusiliers of 6th Platoon. Division Company. Private Schmidt, Royal Gloucestershire, Berkshire and Wiltshire Regiment of 4th Platoon, Prince of Wales Division Company. Finally, Private Hardy, Light Infantry of 4th Platoon, Light Division Company. I'd like to thank all of you, the supporters, and I notice we've got a pretty strong light division support here behind me, but all of you, family supporters, for coming here today and sharing in this very, very special experience for everybody on parade. It means a hell of a lot to them, and it's representative of the support that you've given them, not just today, but in their lives so far, and especially on this extremely demanding course, the toughest course uh, of its type in the army. 
uh, and it's down to you that they have they are here on parade today so now my my main comments today are directed to you the combat infantrymen no longer recruits who stand on parade in front of us and we bask in your glory gentlemen you have come far and i know that you will have had some extremely tough times and some of you will have gone through experiences that you have never thought you would have gone through before some of you might at times have even wondered if you'd be standing here on parade today. But you are, and that is great testament to your guts and your determination. Right, bottle it, remember it. Be proud of yourself, be proud of your regiments, and be proud of being in the British Army. You have joined a great army, and it is a most honourable profession, despite what you'll occasionally read in the tabloids and the media. You are going to do great work out there in the world. We've never been so committed in peacetime. And all of you, if you're not going on operations now, will be going on operations, I have no doubt, in the near future. And you are a force for good in the world. You are our guardians of everything that we, the British, value. So guard it well. The second message I have is this. You've learned a great deal, but don't think it ends here. You've still got a lot more to learn. I was speaking to one or two of the instructors today, and I asked them, have you learned, uh, have you learned new stuff since you've been here as an instructor? And the answer was invariably yes. I am still learning. We're all still learning, so keep an open mind. And my third and final point is this. Congratulations. I want you to know that we are all incredibly proud of you. And we wish you all the best of good fortune wherever you go and for the future. Thank you all very much indeed.